All right, meteorologist Teen Davis and the Weather Pros live. Weatherblogs.com will be watching something for this weekend. We could potentially get some frozen precipitation. We'll go into that shortly, but the Euro and the Canadian are both showing an interesting uh, potential for Saturday, especially if you're up in your D.C. So let's take a look at this model. First, showers and thunderstorms, I would say they're going to be pretty likely going through Wednesday. As you get a strong cold front, Wednesday and Thursday, we're looking at temperatures that are going to be up near 70 degrees, 70 degrees before it comes crashing down. And here's the interesting part, and this actually would be more interesting for even Roanoke at this point, this is the latest uh, Canadian, and like I said, the Euro is kind of following suit. We get heavy, heavy snow coming across the area. Um, this would be... Parts of Lexington, Charlottesville, over here towards D.C. and all that area and outside D.C. to the west. Nice snow, snow up to Jersey, Pennsylvania, Ohio. Then we turn to freezing rain. Here's where our predicament may be, issue, may be an issue here. Would be the freezing rain potential here that would be occurring Saturday into Sunday. Heavy snowfall in Jersey, but there will be a rain snow line. We'll have to see where that would, would hit. And then you have Massachusetts under the gun. So this was definitely something we got to watch closely because, as you see, we do have that potential there. And that would be a Saturday and a Sunday system. So we'll back it up, and then I'll try to pull some, uh, some actual snowfall totals. This is if it occurred. This is still a ways out, and things can change. But we'd be looking at around 2 inches of snow in Roanoke and Sleet. 10 inches here, closer to D.C., 6 inches right around Philly, a little outside, 3 to 6. This will be a swath of heavier um, snowfall if it occurs the way it looks at this point. There may or may not be a storm. This may shift further south and then give a bigger area a chance of snow. We've seen stranger things happen when temperatures have been in the 70s and changed over. The reason that I'm not showing you the GFS, and it's because... It's, it's ridiculous. The GFS, as much as it shows two two inches of snow, maybe a little bit more here in Roanoke, would also be you know lighter on the amounts. So the GFS does say, hey, we may get some. Well, so we have to watch it. But definitely the Euro and the Canadian models have increased their potential. They, this, believe it or not, this is the 18Z, but the GFS has come along with them too now. So that being said. That's showing more agreement. We'll see how it occurs. It's going to be in the 70s, but it'd be odd. Saturday may turn into a snow situation. Um, snow Saturday into Sunday may be an interesting situation. So we'll keep an eye on it for you here at the Weather Pros. Other than that, we'll keep you updated. We'll also be doing a severe weather outlook for the season coming up soon. So stay tuned for that too. Meteorologist Dean Davison, the Weather Pros. Thanks for watching.